guys welcome to Nyuyang Cooking. In this video we are going to try out a recipe that is rather popular in Malaysian Chinese restaurants and this is how to cook Gongbo mantis prawns. Now mantis prawns are really rare especially in Germany so when I got it I saw it I immediately knew I had to cook this and make a video out of it. It is my one of my favorite dish and I hope that you will love this. Gongbo is actually just a type of sauce that which is made out of a dark soy sauce and it's slightly spicy uh, it's just like sweet sour sauce or any other sauces that you know and you can cook it with chicken or beef or uh, even different sort of meat but I choose to cook it with mantis prawns because to me this is the best way to cook it now let's begin with the list of ingredients the ingredients will then begin with mantis prawns now if you haven't seen mantis prawns it's gonna look a little bit creepy but trust me it's delicious so this is how it looks like and I'm going to show you how to clean it later on just to take the meat out for sauces we'll need some soy sauce vinegar a bit of dried chilies and remember to remove the seeds if you do not want it to be too spicy some dark soy sauce for some color sesame oil garlic some ginger and then I also have some scallions and also shallots now to fry this uh, mantis prawns I have a bit of corn flour we also need some salt and sugar to taste and do not forget some white pepper we're going to use the scissors to remove the shell so cut the sides of it and be very careful because they have a lot of uh, sharp edges I'm going to try to remove the back part of the shell and because the meat is very soft so you have to be careful to not tear the meat as you go on so once we reach the tail flip it over then we're going to cut the head away and this time I like to use the help of uh, the plate Carefully try to peel the skin off again. Take the scissors to remove the gut. There you go. So you have the meat of the mantis prawn. I've washed the mantis prawns and cut them into smaller pieces. So now I'm going to dip them into some corn flour and we will fry. It's golden brown and then you can bring it up and leave it aside. Now we're going to heat up the wok and add the sesame oil. Then add ginger and also garlic cook this at low heat and make sure that it is fragrant then add the shallots soy sauce vinegar dark soy sauce Here I'm also going to add a bit of water. So once the gravy is starting to boil, you can add uh, Shaoxing wine if you like and if you do not want to use it, it's okay, this is optional. We're going to add a bit of pepper, some salt and sugar to taste. So when this has been boiling about 2 minutes, we are going to add the scallions and also the dried chilies. When the gravy is boiling and you see that the scallions are slightly softer, I'm going to add here a bit of cornstarch and water just to thicken the gravy. So the sauce is thickened and switch the stove off, then we are add the mantis prawns into the gravy. I 
I'm really happy because one of my favorite dishes is ready. So I can't wait to try it. It is just so good. If you can see the word excitement across my face, delicious across my face, it's just so, so good. You have to try this if you can find mantis prawns, but do not worry if you cannot find them. Just use prawns instead or use chicken, it would work too. But if you have mantis prawns, you have the bonus. So I hope you try this recipe and then tell me what you think in the comment section below or on Google+, Facebook, Twitter or even Instagram. Till then, I wish you happy cooking!